what are some of the positives you can take away from your trip down to Baton Rouge? It was fairly close considering the last couple games. Before. Yeah, uh, well, styles make fights. They were a good style for us. Um, uh, we felt like uh, Brynn gave us some good minutes in there. Rebounding, obviously, size is an issue for us. Uh, Deja was able to make some shots. And we thought we got the looks that we wanted. Now I'm just trying to get the team to understand that every game is a new opportunity and uh, everyone has to do their part. I feel like we've been hanging on three people to do all the scoring and so that's why we're scoring so low. We need other people to make shots and do their part and so we broke it down on what that looks like and hopefully we can grow from there and put some more points on the board. Usually it doesn't seem too hard to convince people to want to shoot, but so what does yeah. somebody struggle there with getting people going? Um, I just think that everybody uh, just wants someone else to do it, you know. Um, a lot of times that's society, you know. You go do it, you know. I, I want you to do it. And uh, it's easier to sit and criticize someone than be the one to go out and do something about whatever it is. And so I really think that uh, Mimi and, and the other kids that had an E hadn't been thinking about the fact that they have to, they're, they have to contribute offensively for us. Because I just think if you can hold someone to 52 points, you should give yourself a chance to win. And uh, we just missed a whole lot of shots. So this last week we were able to get into the gym a lot and uh, I think it'll pay off for us. Brynn has suddenly been given a lot of minutes mm -hmm. lately. Um, what, what is her role kind of moving yeah. forward as you move into this? We just need her to rebound the ball and play with energy. Um, you know, that was a need for us. And, when, and usually you get playing time from practice. And so she had been practicing a little bit better as the time went on and kind of was forced to give her an opportunity because we were just outmanned inside with Tori trying to be down there. She's just too small. Uh, when you play the, the tallest teams in the country, uh, Tennessee being one. So we had to do something and Bryn came in and gave good minutes in and usually that's how it works. And so started to get more confidence in her and she's been in there getting rebounds and, and just making tough plays and that's what we need. How big will that be in her development? Uh, enormous. Huge, 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 huge. For my sanity, uh, just to see um, a kid of her talent out here every day, that's been great and refreshing for me. Um, but for her personally, it's going to be awesome. An opportunity to watch SEC teams play, uh, an opportunity to get healthy, because uh, she's been battling with little injuries throughout the season, which ultimately made her decide to come and then just an opportunity to work with our strength coach and uh, because usually for freshmen that's what they struggle with and so she's going to be way ahead of the game. You know how Robin's teams are going to play, what can you expect yeah. from uh, Missouri here on Sunday? A lot of open shots. Um, they don't guard you. If your percentage says not to guard you, they're going to be tough. Um, they don't care about their record. You know, they come out and, and uh, they're going to play hard, and they have a little bit more seniors than we do, so they're experienced, uh, and uh, we expect a good fight. You recently added a, uh, a practice squad player yeah. to your game day roster. What kind of went into that? Uh, just bodies. We need bodies. Uh, we need we need people to come out and play hard. We think that uh, Tootie, that's what we call it, is, uh, is really can be a pass defensively, and so we're, we're looking to utilize her with that defensively out there, just having her hawk people on the ball and giving us some opportunities to slow people down in transition.